Boy, we're gonna be fresh as hell tomorrow. Yes, yeah, sir. First day of school. I might bust these new J's out though. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. The black jeans. Okay. I'm saying. All right, fresh polo. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I like this polo. Yeah, let's see, let's see. Got the cool gray colors on it. You know what I'm saying? Yellow. Got the yellow stripes in the shirt. Okay, black on the jeans. White. Boom. Yup. That's a fit. Yeah. Uh huh. I know a lot of people might rock these Monday though, but it's all good. Okay. Okay. Got the blue Levi's. The rips in them. Can't never go wrong with a fresh white tee. White forces. Can't never go wrong with all whites. Cocaine's killing them. Straighten my tee out real quick. Straighten that out. Straighten the jeans out. Cuff them like that. Okay. Uh. Crispy all whites too. Mm. Should I just go simple tomorrow with the white tee? Yep, white tee, white forces, blue jeans. Classic. That's classic, boy. Who, who messing with me tomorrow, man? I'm going to bed. I'm going to bed early. Got to make sure I get enough rest. Put the fit right there. I'm leaving this on the bed. That way, whichever fit I want to wear, boom, kill them. Like, dream about this fit. <sighs> YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy, DB Kiss. We're back with another video. Today, I put together a back-to-school sneaker video for you guys. I know school's right around the corner. So, um, I just wanted to put some together and picked out some sneakers that are at retail or below that I feel like are good for back-to-school. There's tons and tons of sneakers that are out there, but I feel like these are the most accessible. And not only that... The prices are pretty uh, pretty fair, depending on what it is, but I'll get into detail about that later on. I hope you guys enjoyed the back-to-school skit that I put together, man. That's just how we used to do it when we was kids. That's how we used to, you know what I'm saying, we laid the outfit on the bed. We went to sleep with the outfit on the bed because, you know what I'm saying, we was excited about school the next day and what everybody's going to be wearing and stuff like that. Um, but anyways, if you are new to the channel, man, go ahead and hit that red button, man. Welcome to the DB Kicks channel, the DB Game. But before I get into that, uh, thank you to all the old subscribers, new subscribers. Uh, we're growing. I appreciate it. I say it all the time, but I really do mean it. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get it to the list right now. I'm going to be in and out of my phone, just kind of looking at prices because I want to give you guys the most accurate information as of now as I'm recording this. So let's go ahead and get into it. This is in no particular order. All right, so the first sneaker that I got on the list today is the Air Jordan 1 Gym Brand. These recently recently released, I think in like, I don't know, July? Was it? I'm, I'm not sure. But um, you can find pairs of these for as low as like $150 in uh, men's sizes. Of course, that varies per size. If you're like my size, size 8, you already know how that goes with the money sizes. That costs more, but you have sizes like 12 and a half, 14. So depending on what size you wear, you can find pairs of these for as low as $150. Uh, white, black, and red. You know, a lot of kids don't have the bread to go back and get the bread one or the Chicago one. So I feel like this is a good alternative. All right, so moving on from the Air Jordan 1. Uh, this is a, a sneaker that I personally actually like. And if I catch it in an outlet or something, definitely would love to cop it. But this is the Air Jordan 3 Tinker. I have this, uh, this Tinker in my collection. I really like this one a lot. I ended up getting it for under retail because I paid retail for it and I realized I said 225 that's way too expensive. So I took them back and I ended up getting them for cheaper. But this colorway specifically is the black cement. So you have hits of all black. Um, it's an all black sneaker. I feel like it's good to wear because you can't really mess it up too much. It's classic and it's got a little twist on it with the swoosh on it. And you can find pairs of these for as low as $154 right now. So right now I'm looking at StockX. Um, between StockX and GOAT, but I'm probably going to focus more on StockX because I never purchased from GOAT. I know StockX is under a lot of fire right now. So the Black Cement Air is running 3 Tinker. Moving on to what I feel like is the best Jordan right now for back to school is the Air Jordan 4 and the cool gray colorway. Now I know you guys seen that I reviewed this sneaker. If you haven't seen that review yet, go check it out. But um, this this is, for me, if I was going back to school and my mom said, usually how it went for me was I'd get my all white shoe, i get an all black shoe, and i get one nice shoe with color in it. So this would definitely be the shoe that I will pick. Um, all gray, hits a yellow, white, and black, and it's easy to wear. So that's 
kind of what I would look for as a kid. I'm like, well, what can I wear this way? Can I get the most outfits out of it? This is definitely it. This is a classic clean sneaker. You can find pairs of these for at retail in your store still or online. I've seen prices for as low as like 185. So not too much on the retail, but hey, if you guys got coupons or anything, you can knock that price down even lower from $190. Moving on from the Air Jordan 4 Cool Gray. Now this right here, in my opinion, this is the ultimate back to school sneaker. This is the back to school sneaker that you had to have. Every kid got, and sometimes you even got another pair when Christmas time hits. So the all white forces, man, the, come on. The all white Air Force One, it's no explanation needed. It goes with everything, it's classic. This would be the shoe that I promise you like, a good 80% of kids are gonna bust these out day one. I promise you, the all white forces, man. So you never can go wrong with this pair. What do you think? Watch down there in the cut. Mm -hmm. What you think? All white forces back to school? Classic. There it is. She already said it. Sorry. You know, when we were in middle school and high school, we did all white low tops and high tops. Yeah, yeah. So our, some people our used to get. Not the anymore? No, no, no. So they, I mean, they're still cool, but some people did the all white forces because they look better with like shorts. Mm -hmm. And some people did the mids and the highs with the pants. So they got two. But I, I never had that luxury. I always got one high or low. You warm with low. Or what mid. The, what were those pants called with the. Oh, the Jabot jeans? <laughs> she didn't even have to say the name. The Jabot jeans? Man, <laughs> all white forces with the. Man. Today's kids do not even know the, the, the type of clothing that we used to do, man. It was crazy, but moving on from that. So the next shoe I got on my list today, this is an ultimate classic, also in my opinion. And this is the cheapest shoe that you can get on this list, and that is the Vans Old School Low. I think these retail for what, $50? 50? 50. I don't have a pair. She has a pair. I think they're 50 they're like 50 bucks, but they're all black. Mix it, uh, you got to mix some materials on there, a little bit of suede, a little bit of canvas, and it just looks good with like everything. It's not too comfortable, but it's not uncomfortable. You just got to break them in. It's good all around. You got to break them in, but they are good for anything. I got Vans, but they're just not in that color. All right, next sneaker that I have today. So this is a shoe that I feel like I need to snag. The wife has a pair, but I need it. And this is the all-white Stan Smith with the green. So the all-white classic green. Classic shoe, they retail like $80. You could probably find them online for cheaper. Um, matter of fact, let me look right now. Last pair, my size sold for 61 so there you have it. So the Stan Smith, it's a dope shoe, all white, green, comfortable. You can't go wrong with it. All right, so the next sneaker that we have today, I'm not too big of a fan of it, but I like the colors on it, if that makes sense. But I think these are good for back to school, especially if you have children. The Biotech Air Max 90. You just got a bunch of colors going on. These things are going on for retail on Nike.com. That is select sizes, of course. So online, you can find the Air Max 90 Biotech for as low as like $110. For $110. So you can't beat that. Um, just really good. I mean, the Air Max 90 is classic. I own a bunch of them. Um, it's just a good shoe. It's comfortable. I actually wore a pair of 90s today. So yeah, if I was going back to school, I'd definitely pick these because... This is like that shoe like you want like a loud fit, you know what I'm saying, with like a nice polo t-shirt or something. I feel like the Air Max 90 Biotech, this is it right here. So these are cold for back to school in my opinion. And they come all the way down to like toddler sizes, I believe. So you can't beat that. Next sneaker we got today. Now, I haven't actually tried this sneaker myself because I'm still stuck on the other model. And this is the Nike Air Max 270 React. You can find pairs of these for as low as... Um, about $110 from what I've seen. I've never tried the shoe out. Um, I'm still rocking the Presto React, but one day I definitely do want to get around to it. It's just a, it's a nice shoe. It's got a React forefoot, and you got the Nike Air bubble in the back, for the 270 Air bubble. So I think that's pretty cool. And they, this Bauhaus color, if I say that right specifically, this is like the best colorway to me. Um, it's a nice shoe. So. Definitely recommend the 270 and it goes all the way down to taller sizes as well. All right, next sneaker we got today, I wanted to mix it up a little bit. And lately I've been heavy into Nike SB. I wanted to throw in the Nike SB Dunk High in the camo colorway. All black suede, canvas camo, white swoosh, can't beat it. Send a kid to school in a shoe like this 
and you know they might mess it up like this is perfect i definitely want to get a pair myself i know they're still sitting around in stores for 100 bucks that's the retail price 100 dollars but you can find these for as low as 71 dollars online right now the last shoe that i have on my list today i don't actually have this shoe but i stand behind the model 100 percent and that is the yeezy 700 in the black and gum colorway i really like that shoe i don't have it this right here is the way runner if you don't know but um i wear the 700 a lot this is a shoe that um you know like i said just now with the sbs you send a kid to school with some some black easy 700s on all suede gum bottom good quality they can beat the hell out the shoe and it's still gonna come out nice so that that's definitely that pair I like and I also like the analog too so you can find let's look right now you can find these for as low as like I think I looked earlier I think 254 250 so you can find pairs of the easy 700 black and gum bottoms for 250 now I know a lot of parents aren't gonna go drop 250 on a shoe for a kid 100% understand that my mom was not dropping 250 she would give me shoes but not not 250 to 300 dollars shoes these retail at 300 so this is a shoe that I recommend maybe for your high school kids. You know, you got a part-time job, you you have to buy your own shoes because I know when I got in high school, um, hey, you got a job, you buy it yourself. So I definitely would spend the, definitely would spend the 250 on these and I make this like one of my everyday sneakers in high school. So I feel like this is better for the high school kids that are making a little money. So definitely recommend this shoe. So let me know what you guys think about the list. Um, I had a good time putting this list together. So if you ha if you don't know, so this is what I'm looking at right now in my video. So the Stock X actually has an under retail section. So you have cool grays, gold toes. So these are this is where I'm getting my prices from. This is kind of like just market prices. You don't have to get them from here. You can search in store. Or you can search on GOAT either way. But there's a tons and tons of shoes that are under retail. There's the analog right there. That's the one I really like. She likes that one too. The white and cream one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are dope as hell. Um, Jordan 1's for 120 So the steals are out there. You don't have to go and get the most expensive shoe. You don't have to go and get the, try to get the, the, the Yeezy 350. The reason why I didn't put a 350 on here because you, they're not accessible. You know, at below retail very rarely I just wanted to get make this video to help you guys out maybe help some parents out maybe help some kids out that are trying to get this last minute school shopping in so thank you guys for watching the video's not gonna stop coming we're working we're grinding every day and we are out of here